one of the beautiful things about living in America, we all have a right to our own opinion. I love that. But let's take a look at Kamala Harris and Donald Trump. You see, with Miss Harris and y'all all, Kamala um, supporters and Trump supporters have to all admit one major thing about her. She dances around every question thrown at her. If she's asked about the border, she goes straight into bashing Trump. If she's asking about the economy, she starts talking about her mom and how she was raised. If she's talk, if they ask her about abortion, she goes into the Roe v. Wade. But actually identifying the problem and a solution to it, she's never done it. She was recently on the Oprah Winfrey, this little interview with Oprah. And that means they're bringing out the big guns because they know Oprah is loved by many women throughout the world. So figuring Oprah can help her to move her campaign further kind of backfired. Because if you take a look at that interview, you're going to see for yourself and look at Oprah's expressions. And on a few occasions, Oprah even had to step in when Kamala was babbling about all these things that doesn't make sense or have anything to do with the question that was asked. And Oprah had to break it down to her like she was a child. And still she could not answer these questions. This should lead people to understand she is not fit to run a country. She's not even in the White House yet. And she can't even handle sitting down taking interviews. People, we got to actually see the bigger picture. It's not, <clears throat> it shouldn't be about a popularity contest. Nor should it be about hatred. It should be about what's best for the country. We see racists on both sides. But let's be honest here. Democrat Party, every time they've gotten office, we have not succeeded. We have not moved forward. They keep talking about what well, Trump wants to live in the past and we're going for the future. The thing I'm looking at, the future seems to be shitty coming our way. And it has nothing to do with us. This new future that they're proposing looks like it's destruction of the middle and the poor class. We have a chance to change that direction. And many of you, you see this yourself. We have a chance. We need to come together on something real for all of us, not for a few. Don't take the word of the celebrities. We already know money is their God. We have to look out for one another and actually start making sense of what our future needs to be and start coming together and coming to grips and realize if we vote the wrong way this coming election, it can eat, it can go two ways. Very good or the downfall of the Americans.